Welcome back folks. Today I'm excited and I am excited to be showing you around this delightful two I think it was registered, it was on my birthday, 1st of October 2007. So what does that mean? 15 years old, wait for it, one owner and one driver from brand new. She's just tripped, I picked her up yesterday. I had to go down south, uh, we lost a, a passport. Uh, when delivering her in order to sleep at a Belfast last week so I had to go to the London passport office so I collected this and on my travels so I did over 200 miles and yesterday travelling to London and back um, it drives absolutely fantastic I will encourage the fussiest of detailers purchasers inspectors anybody can inspect this and drive as I say I drove over 200 miles back from London there's not a rattle shake, you can just tell that one person has drove that from brand new and has looked after it. I think there's five stamps in the service book, last stamped a couple of years ago, at 2,000 miles ago. Um, I'll carry out another service before it leaves our premises. This is going to delight the new owner. Okay, let's show you around. So this is an, or an auto sleeper Orion Zeta. Basically, Orion was a sub-brand of auto sleeper. So made in the same factory, all the same design inside, all the upholstery was even um, taken care of at Premier Furnishings that have been doing auto sleeper upholstery for years. Just a slightly different design to the original auto sleeper fabric detail. Um, basically, it's an auto sleeper Nuevo. It's a two berth, it's on the Peugeot chassis, 2.2 turbo diesel, does it fly, five speed. So yeah, it's exactly the same as an auto sleeper Nuevo. Okay, so let's uh, show you around. It's even got the auto sleeper job number and chassis in the glove box. So you can ring up auto sleeper, quote the job number, and you can get any parts you require. It's just had a new MOT. Just, uh, was it a couple of weeks ago? It has been MOT no less than about 10 or 11 times from when it was on its third year anniversary. Every single MOT has not had a single advisory. Yes. So can you imagine the checks that this has had over the last uh, 11, 12 years? And no MOT inspector could even find anything to advise on. It's that good. It's uh, all that I'm going to do. There's a couple of little marks on a couple of trims here. I think a corner bumper, it's got a little scratch here. So I'm just going to get that touched in at the body shop professionally. And it's just got two, I don't know why, it's the same on the other side. It's perhaps stone chipping on this elevation i'm not quite sure but just there and exactly the same on the uh, driver's side so it's going to go into the body shop that will be repainted so will the other side that will be touched in and i'm going to instruct them to give it a full machine polish it will just bring it up to its former glory i'm just i'm going to run out of superlatives it's just wonderful diesel outside locker your Fiorma industry standard F45 awning. I've had that wound up. Two fr fridge vents there, winter covers. Everything is it should be. Uh, have I got an electric step or is it a window? I'm not quite sure. No, it's a manual step. So we've got a manual step. Coming around the back, we've got the Fiorma two carry bike rack. Looks nice just clips back into there and two clips of bikes okay coming around not much else to show you on the rear high level brake light of course on the driver's side you've got all the access to all the leisure bits and bobs so you've got the flush water for your chemicals for the toilet you've got the standard Bedford cassette toilet you've got the Truma flu vent that's the winter cover for heating the hot water on gas, mains electric hookup, fresh water, uh, you've got the tap here for the underslung water tanks to dispose of, uh, we've got the gas cupboard, oh he's left you two, two six kilogram propane bottles, you might be aware there is a shortage of uh, Cali gas bottles in the United Kingdom as we speak just after Covid times. Uh, so it's handy that you've actually got, there's no shortage of gas, so as long as you've got a, a gas bottle, you can exchange it anywhere in the country at a Cala gas dealer. So it's nice that you've got two to get started. As a spur. Yeah, so it's just got that little mark, I don't know why. Just at the same, 
is on the passenger side. Uh, yeah, the last guy's own love. He's actually put extra carpets in. So what he's done, he's got the driver's over mat. He's cut himself a mat to go on the cab area. He's actually cut himself an extra mat to go in the leisure area. And there's the original water sleeper over mats. Yeah, I'd be happy to deliver this. I know it won't last long on this new shape Peugeot chassis. 2.2 five speed uh, all the auto sleeper finishings and quality that you would expect it's not going to last this one owner 30,000 miles full service history every MOT without an advisory of course I'll get it checked over for a habitation everything will be working as it should be before it goes out of collection or I'll deliver it anywhere in the UK um, you can have three months total warranty and I'm that confident you can have 12 months warranty on the engine and gearbox. The new owner will want for nothing. Right, well let's, uh, we'll send Dennis the drone for a little fly over upstairs and then uh, I'll take you inside. Okay Dennis, over to you. Thanks for that flyover, Dennis the Drone. Okay, equally as exciting is to get in and show you around this. I did say it was delightful. And there you go, all the auto sleeper furnishings has been done by Premier Furnishings in Derby. They've been doing auto sleeper for many years. There's just lots of little features there. Yeah, so it's got the auto sleeper build number and chassis number there. Five speed manual. Look at that steering wheel. You can tell it's just had one driver. Steering wheel dead straight, dead centre when you're driving. Not a vibration, wobble, noise from the front or the rear. So that's just a testament to the one owner, careful driving as well as the auto sleeper fixtures and fittings. There's just lots of little details. See, auto sleeper, no one else, all over manufacturer, but you just put one sleeve there for the curtains. Typical of auto sleeper to belt and brace, do everything as it should be done properly. This is why they uh, have a very good reputation in the industry and hold the value second hand. Very straightforward, all to sleeper have known for their uh, control panels, literally on and off. Control panels for the hot water on gas, as well as the Truma Ultra Heat. So that will be working while camping on gas or on electricity when you're plugged into the mains. You've got the control panel. Ah, so these, what I was saying, these are the original auto sleeper, brand new, never been used. These are the over mats clip into there's clips there they clip into here and clip in there but the last owner these are my dirty marks this morning i'm sorry about that i'll get that clean for you uh, but the last owner has put an over he's fitted a carpet there he's even fitted carpets underneath the stowage stays as well as one at the front with mats over there so you can see the level of detail and how it's been looked after it will slide out extra work surface top there Dometic fridge freezer that works on the gas while camping mains when you're plugged in or driving on the 12 volts plenty of main sockets as well as 12 volt to work off the leisure battery that's probably the most important cabin cabinet perhaps when you've uh, pulled in after a long drive the wine cabinet it's even got the original crockery. Rafts of paperwork. I'll go through that shortly. 
Looks like some extra, now what is that? I don't know, perhaps some floor covers or extra curtains, I'm not quite sure. So we're uh, just walking around. So above the cab, so we've got some extra filling cushions there. It's just lovely. What's that? Looks like a TV aerial extension. You've got the large roof light. So you've got the blackout there, the fly net, and of course this can be opened on both sides and lifted up. We've got fly nets and blackouts to every window and everything is just operating exactly as it left the auto sleeper factory 15 years ago. Yeah, it's quite hard to grasp that this is 15 years old, but now and again, you do get these little low mileage love gems and this is one of them. So the first person with a 500 pound deposit secures it. I know this won't last long. And I'll be happy for you to come and collect it here at Camper Nerd HQ in Scarisbrick near Southport. Or I'm quite happy and content to deliver it anywhere in the mainland United Kingdom. I'll even do uh, Ireland. I delivered an auto sleeper to Belfast last week with an extra charge for the uh, ferry as well as the flight back. Well, that's not a problem. Nicely, the grill, oven, walking in the wet room, that's all nice underneath the shower trays, all proper, present, cor correct. Toilet's all nice and clean and being sanitised. Shower, bathroom light, hot and cold water, large vanity mirror. Yes, so there you are. So this is just a recap. A 2007, October 2007, Auto Sleep Orion Zeta. So it's basically an Auto Sleeper New Avo with a different badge. It's all come out of the same factory. One owner from brand new. It's got all the service history. I'll stamp up the service history again and get the oil changed on the engine. And then it'll carry my full warranty. Yeah, it wants nothing really, just a new owner. That's the uh, crank handle for the awning. So just walking outside. I'll be away on my annual holidays, the beginning of June for two weeks. So I'm just doing my best to get a few more ready before I go away. Um, that one's just arrived, a 96 Auto Sleeper Symphony, same as a symbol, just the earlier model. And I've also just arrived a 99 on a T Reg Auto Sleeper uh, Harmony. Very rare and desirable moddy, model. The Harmony is just a short wheelbase that's so just, just a fraction shorter, but it has the upstairs for the ch two child birth uh, bedding arrangements. That's just arrived. That's just gone into the uh, workshop now to have a look, make sure, and uh, that will be coming on sale next. So I'm assuming the Harmony will be on sale next and then the Symphony and there's another symbol due. So those are due shortly. My name's Anthony Valentine, the Camper Nerd, 0798 526. And I'll be happy to answer any questions as I repeat, 500 pound deposit will secure this delivered anywhere in the United Kingdom under full warranty and I'll be happy to answer any questions 9am till 6pm every day. Thanks for watching folks, I'll catch you on that next video, hopefully it'll be the Auto Sleeper Harmony.